It has been a very long time since I've reacted to a DJ Cook video, and some of you guys have really wanted me to react to the three new DJ Cook videos he has posted that I forgot to react to. I already reacted to his newest video, I Found the Worst Girl on YouTube, but today I'll be watching his second newest video, Meet the Most Spoiled Kid on YouTube. Alright, here is the video. Let's do this. Yo, what's up? A Christmas episode. So this a couple weeks ago, I was just super bored. Everybody was in what? school, and you know, I just graduated last year. So I was just sitting around. Christmas was coming up, and I didn't really have a video planned out. And right there, at that moment, I got the best idea ever. I decided to go on a short adventure to find the most spoiled brats on YouTube. And no, I'm not talking about the super rich families that buy their kids a Tesla when they shoot out of the womb. <laughs> worse than that. I saw this. This... And a lot of this. You'll see what I mean. Is that a picture of a dog? A oh, hold on, hold on. Was that a dog? Well, that's interesting. Let's keep watching. Channel. If you're new here, we basically try to clean up the bad people on YouTube. And if you want to help me clean up YouTube, click subscribe. But if you don't want to subscribe, that's good. I expose bad YouTube. Sit back and enjoy my videos. When I decided that I wanted to do a Christmas episode of Meet the YouTubers, I knew it had to relate with Christmas. I didn't want to do a video like meet the guy who records himself every time he takes a sh the video that I <laughs> for Christmas. Okay, what is Christmas. that? And that's when I thought of the idea of finding some super spoiled kids. So I'm not I that spoiled for say, but kids. maybe a little. Like one billion YouTube channels. How was I gonna find I'm not like I first decided to do this video. Those rich kids on TikTok, but it was actually going to be, but I knew <laughs> Back on December 3rd, 2021. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Was that exactly two months ago? I think today is the third. It actually is. That was exactly two months ago. Three weeks ago. That's the day when I decided to start making this video that you're watching. I just needed to find one. What is that Santa Claus guy doing like a dance in the back? I just realized that that sounds kind of weird, but whatever. To get started, I just decided to search up on YouTube spoiled kids, and all I found was just a bunch of stupid YouTubers who were reacting to some spoiled kid compilations. Oh yeah, those clickbait videos and like dog man. Get out of here, SS Sniper Wolf. So SS searched, Sniper Wolf. And I searched and I searched and I didn't find anything. And then I searched up buying my son. And the reason I searched Oh, up this is gonna be good. Where someone was like buying their son a bunch of toys or buying their son a Tesla. Something like that. But I ended up finding Oh yeah, I saw videos that buying my son a Tesla. Buying everything our one year old baby touches. And the thumbnail is a baby that what? just shot out of the womb, grabbing iPhones and iPads. Does this kid really need all of that? This is confused. The only thing he's going to do with that iPhone is shove it down his throat so far and then end up choking. But it's <laughs> a video idea for YouTube, right? We're going to get so many views. See if he wants it. Oh, of course he wants a car. Are you sure you want that? That's a nice car, Papa. All right, for right. You know what to do, bro. Right, Where you at? We gotta get it. We gotta get it. Your son has good taste. I love the pink and gray color. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, put it in the cart. This is gonna be a workout for you today, bro. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's going for more. He's going for no. Oh, this kid is getting whatever he touches. He probably. I wish I could just do that. Just go to a store with my mom's credit card and be like, bye, bye, bye. Puts his hands on, and he doesn't even know English. Get about it. Oh, you already got one. You already got that, bro. One per person. One per per. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Hold up. Hold up, he touched that shelf, so you better rip that thing out of the ground. <laughs> he deserves it. So they bought about 20 toys for this little kid, and now they're taking him to a candy store. And I oh, no. Not the sugar. Which way is he going to grab? Oh, oh, oh. Well, actually, I might be able to do this with a candy store, because each piece of candy, like, there's a candy store that's, like, 40 minutes away from my house. Each candy, there's, like, two bucks. He's just going on a roll. He's he's going on a he's going on a ham. He's going insane with the I, I don't even know what that candy's called. Oh, that actually looks like would taste good. I I wish I was that kid. I bet he'll have no use for those candies whatsoever because he'll probably forget this exact moment. And to be honest, I'll probably forget this exact moment right now where I'm reacting to this video, but still. Hey, but I have one question for you, royalty family. I thought that 
thumbnail showed him at the Apple store getting phones and iPads. Where was that at in the video? Oh, yeah, I forgot. You're clickbaiting and you're spoiling your kids to death. Now, you might be kind of mad at me saying, hey, DJ, what's wrong with them? Well, I guess it's okay to spoil your kids when they're like two years old, but as soon as they turn like four or five, when they can actually start remembering stuff, don't. So pretty much, they're going to deck out their son's room with a whole bunch of kids' stuff. Surprising our son with a childish room makeover? That Paw Patrol? That's a toilet? Oh, so they're like getting him toddler stuff. Paw Patrol toilets exist? Oh no. This is my parents, just cringe. No, okay, my parents aren't that cringe. Paw Patrol. And that was my tipping point. This kid has a $300 desk, three $300 TVs, a $600 flat screen TV above those, a gaming computer that probably cost $3,000, a humongous bed, and he's mad at them for changing the wallpaper on his computer. <laughs> Yeah, this guy's definitely spoiled. Okay, let me show you your toilet. Come on in, come in, come in. That's your new toilet right there. This is your new This kid has his own bathroom too? When I was a kid, Oh wait, he like, does. I had to trek all the way across the house just to get there. And he's got one in his room. Now once again, there isn't anything My house has three bathrooms, but I don't really know why there's three. If anything, there should be two, but there's one in my downstairs place. One even me. No, two in my upstairs, and then none in my basement. I'd take a million poops in that Paw Patrol toilet if it meant that I could have a super nice bed, an expensive gaming setup, and my own bathroom attached to my bedroom at 10 years old. Yeah. They made another video where they gave their son their credit card, and they gave him one hour to get whatever he wanted. Oh, just my God. Just go to the PS5 and go, swipe, 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 swipe. That these kids are spoiled brats because they seem like awesome kids, but it really starts to get weird when you think about it. I know. They're just wanting all this money for their kids and giving their kids an extremely lavish lifestyle. Once those kids grow up, they might expect everything to be handed straight to them. That's not good. Well, I think everyone knows that that's not really the case with real life, but... No budget at Best Buy? That was the thumb... That was the title of one of the videos. Who's the Ace family? Oh. Look at that amazing Photoshop. Oh, they're gonna be playing. So like we paying attention to you? No. Is he like renting the Lamborghini? Or does he literally have his own Lambo? What are your friends gonna think when they see my car? And she was like, I don't know. They're gonna be playing. This was just so weird to me. But to be honest, she is care. spitting facts because at that age, like six or seven, no one cares about cars. It's like my age, ten or eleven. They literally eat, scream, poop, and sleep all day. Why would they care about a two hundred thousand dollar car? Yeah. <laughs> Do you guys like Elle's car? Okay, okay, let's go. All right, family, so we made it back home. They didn't say anything to him at all. <laughs> they just don't care about cars unless it's... The They're just looking at him. They're just happy that they see the girl. No, they don't care about the car. 90 million subscribers? Oh my god. Why can't I have 90 million subscribers? I don't even have a thousand. Well, hit that subscribe button like right down there or something like that. I don't know. So you remember earlier in this video when I talked about how the royalty family bought everything that their son touched? If you didn't think that could get any worse, just look at this. Buying everything my son touches in Roblox Adopt Me. Oh, who, who plays Adopt Me? And it's not even like a real father and son. It's the same dude talking with his normal voice and then talking with a voice changer. Is it actually? 
Okay, keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed. And now just walk around. The first thing you do. Wait, I think it might be. And you got the pink one too. So after that, I needed to finish off the Christmas episode with something. That is just cringe, honestly. Something that we could all laugh and this is the royalty family. Like, shouldn't they be making other spoiled rap videos and not just that? After all, it was Christmas, and I didn't want this episode to be completely serious. So I went out on my way to find something fun. <gasps> I found a video from an old friend of ours. We all know him. Oh, top 10 speed. Every video and steals full videos from people. He posted a video about. Oh, I remember that video, yeah. Idol literally says, Kid shoots dad after he takes his PS5. Okay, what? I have to see this. Oh my god. So, number 10 is a kid who breaks his iPhone because he wants a new one. Maybe the next one will show a kid shooting his dad. Oh my god. PS4. He got a PS4. Are you freaking kidding me? He does not seem happy. He dropped the PS4? He got a hammer? And his dad's just recording it like nothing. What do you mean fried my mind? You have no idea. And these people are just burning a Christmas tree while fighting. Number one. Click bait. Like that. This episode was just a super fun episode that I wanted to make pretty quickly so I could get it done for you by Christmas. This video was pretty much. Did this video get uploaded by Christmas though? That's the question. Okay, let's see. Go down here. December 23rd. Yes! He did it! I am going to actually watch that video. Me, the weirdest family on YouTube. I'm going to watch that video. Like, at the top, but like, right here-ish. I'm going to watch that video within the next about three days or something. Because I might make some, like, YouTube shorts or something like that. But I'm not 100% sure. I could do it tomorrow. Could do it the following day. Could do it the following day after tomorrow. I, I don't know. But just... I'll upload it soon, okay? That's all you guys need to know. Leave a like and subscribe. Bye.